Uh, currently at Burra Market, one of London's largest street food market. It's got a lot of uh, history. Um, started obviously in 1849, uh, but it's just grown from then. There's a lot of culture, a lot of food, a lot of uh, fruit and vegetables, a lot of seafood, raw fish, raw meat, that kind of thing. Back when it started, it was just raw meat, raw fish. But it's established, it's established like cultures now. So there's a lot of cultures all around the world. Um, you get Italy, you know, India, all sorts of cultures here. Um, there's, it is quite busy, but um, if you go at the right time, you can uh, beat the queues, beat the crowds, and have a great time with your family and friends. Um, but yeah, the vibes here is quite nice. Um, people from all over the world um, coming to Borough Market. But I'm just going to switch the camera around and show you guys all the stalls in Borough Market. Uh, they're selling a lot of cheese. Uh, where's this cheese from? Oh, I'm getting ignored. So it looks like it's from a different part of the world. Did it get an Italian, yeah? It would have been nice just to be courteous and ask if it was okay to film and ask questions. You have a right to, but it's being polite. Okay, okay, thank you. Have a good day. You too. What did she say? Uh, so they've got all sorts of, uh, I don't know what this is, um, uh, spices. Coriander seeds, you have a Chili powder. Hot chili flakes, so just like normal spices. Oh, great. Thank you. Kim. Oriental, Middle East, so spices from all over the world. Taste Croatia, uh, cheeses from Croatia, meats, and other stuff, oils, patty, truffle patty, I don't know what that is, oils, so all sorts of like, you know, different countries uh, in the uh, borough market. Mozzarella stand, so there's a lot of cheeses and stuff. It's not just, you know, street food that you see in places like Camden Market. We had been like sort of pack you and I saw him like he was like a little bit sorry, you know, obviously talking, cracking some jokes with his family. Um, so I think they've got different sections. So this is the cheese section, isn't it? Yeah, that's quite like the French sort Where's this uh, cheese from guys? Where's this cheese from? France. France. So this cheese is from France. No, no, thank you. Field and flour. They've got jam, marmalade, and things like that. So, like different kinds of fruits here. So, if you live around here, you're a local, you come down. Have some nice fruit. Fresh. Not like fresh from Spain, but I don't know, fresh from somewhere, I guess. But it looks amazing. But yeah, I think you can also exit the market from this way. And you can also, it's quite a big market, so you can get around from different directions. You got vegetables here as well Ted's veg. Cheap three well, I don't know, 40p each. That is quite expensive, isn't it, for a northerner? Well, yeah, instead of going to Morrison's and you know Tesco's, go to Borough Market for your fruit and vegetables. Help their local businesses. You got more jam here. But I don't think this is this is just like normal jam. Yeah, yeah, 
they're nice. More cheeses. It's like this place is built of built from cheese. I bet there's a lot of ruts around. Silas uh, is around. French. So obviously Burra Market has been here since the 12th century, but obviously back then there wasn't all of this. You've got a Turkish, uh, Turkish place which sells Turkish delights, Turkish deli. It's just a normal cafe selling English breakfast and things like soup of the day. It's got a massive variety of places. It's not just you know normal street food places like you know donuts and things like that. But you can get all sorts of um, food items here. Oh, is that fish and chips? Nice or fresh fish? Hello. Hello. Hey, what would you like? Sorry, right? So there's different section for cheese place, there's different section for fish place now. Pieces as well if you 
want to cook them home if you live locally.